and this is the last time that this people will play together. And, um, you know, you cherish those moments. They you cherish the fact that they have so many talented peers around them that, that uh, they can do amazing things. And I've been doing this, obviously, a real long time. <laughs> and uh, I have people, you know, kids that have been, you know, that are in their 40s now that, that talk about how sacred this moment is and, and being in the moment. And I, I really feel it exceptionally tonight. I'm afraid that this group has worked super, super hard. I think it's appropriate, you know, in following our military kind of theme, like Calvary Overture, now we're doing uh, one of the mammoth overtures that's ever been written, uh, the 1812 Overture. Most people think that the 1812 Overture was written uh, because it's played at, you know, 4th of July and stuff like that, but it was written celebrating the uh, American, uh, no. celebrating the, uh, the American um, victory over the British Empire in 1812, but that is not it at all. It's, uh, it's essentially Tchaikovsky, uh, was commissioned like, I think, probably in like 1880 or so to write a piece because the first time it was, per it was performed was in 1882. And it was, it was commissioned for him to depict uh, Napoleon actually being run out of Moscow, you know, by the Russian army. So, you know, and just so you know, this is kind of a uh, programmatic, that kind of is a programmatic piece. And it, um, you're going to hear a very solemn, you know, opening to it, very spiritual type of soulful Russian melody, you know, and uh, then we're going to hear some wham bam cannons and uh, the church bells of all of Europe that are celebrating the defeat of Napoleon and uh, just a lot of fun and a lot of work has gone into this because believe me it's a bear. And I'd like to especially thank um, my good friend Terry Farrow who has once again, you know, figured in both parts and did it in a miraculously wonderful way to make it accessible to these guys. So um, really thank you so much for having such wonderful kids. I'd like to thank you know my wife Lisa and, and, and um, uh, this is Troy and uh, Heather and Melissa, our music team down here, and uh, especially Mrs. McCarthy is like been behind this thing a thousand percent, you know, for a very, very long time. So but most of all, thank you and most of most of all, thank you. All right, let's kill it.